I was a little whip Father captain of this big old ship Sail on now in a crazy fit Trying to find a treasure <laughs> We swing on by, sing a couple of songs, and then start to cry. Where we still carry on, sailing along until the favorite song came around about dawn. Heidi, 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 ho! We got six salty blood and watery soul. Once upon a time, we had to think outside the box. inside of this box and I'm frustrated because we've been looking for the key everywhere to the ship of treasure and we can't find it. How are you? I'm bored. Inside this plain boring box there's nothing to do and we can't even find the key. Well, boxes can be useful. Yeah, like if you need to carry something or organize something. But when faced with a problem, like boredom, or a missing key, you can always step outside of the box. Yeah. And look at the problem from a new perspective. <sighs> and that's the key! We found the key! Outside of the box. What does the key say? says ingenuity. Do you know what that means? Let's look it up in the dictionary. Yeah. Ingenuity. Ingenuity. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. Ingenuity. Ingenuity. The quality of being clever and imaginative. Well, we can be those things, and so can you. Let's step aboard the ship of treasure and use this key to open the treasure chest. Ready? Ready? One, two, three! Treasure! I hope what's inside the treasure chest today can help fix our boredom. Me too. Huh? Nothing? This has never happened before. Okay, let's look at this from another angle. Let's put our heads together. Great idea! Let's go explore the many ways people can think outside of the box. Yes, what a good idea! Lesson one, a new view. Should we go on a hike? Yes, great idea. Let's step outside into nature. Maya, which way should we go? Hmm. Well, there's this path. Or there's this path. What do you feel like? I think this is a situation where we need to think outside the box. 
it makes a lot of sense to go that way because this is the path we've been on. But I have a hunch that the other path might yield something interesting. Maybe there's a treasure. Cool. I'm so glad we stepped outside the box and came outside today. This way. Maya, come over here. There's a treasure in this tree. Ah, a different perspective. A new way to look at the world. Hmm. Interesting. A new lens. A new view. We found a treasure. Cool. Ever look. I changed my perspective and what did I see? Boxes of treasure opened for me. Maya, what did you learn while we were on our hike? I learned that thinking outside the box is thinking of doing things in a different way than usual. Ever, what did you learn while we were on our hike? I learned that all around there's treasure to be found. Come into life This is where you'll feel free Like the birds in the sky And the fish in the sea Come into life This is where some ingenuity. Here's some ingenuity. Oh, thank you. Do you know a mechanic that could help fix it for us? I'm gonna climb up and put that hat in there. Yeah, yeah, please help us. Oh, yeah. Aha! I, I see it. You see it? What does it look like? Here's I got our studio. Let's go. Oh. Lesson two, create a box. We've arrived at Treasure Box Island. And look at all the boxes. They come in all shapes and sizes and materials. Here's one right here. Look how beautiful it is. Let's take a look inside. Ooh, I found some beads, Bye. some leaves, and some coins. Let's decorate a treasure box today. I have this old shoe box. Inside I brought some materials to decorate it with. It's kind of falling apart, but I think I can fix that. Yay! We got it! So let's get crafting. Yeah, 
Oh good, we got some glue on it. And you can use anything that you find at your house, whether that's a milk carton, or maybe an old shoe box, or just a piece of paper. It could connect to the other one and be friends with the little pom-pom. What materials can be used to decorate a treasure box? Glue, paper, scissors, stickers, stamps, pipe cleaners, glitter, feathers, crayons, ink, pastels, colored pencils, Treasure boxes are treasure boxes because you value what's inside of them. What do you value? What do you treasure? Lesson three, what's inside the box? Let's ask Professor Roy G. Biv. Excuse me, Professor. I'm sure all of you out there can make a wiggly line. <laughs> And if you can make a wiggly line, you can also make a straight line. Let's see what we can make with just a few straight lines. Now we made that. Now let's see what we can do with some more straight lines. Look, something is happening. Oh, you know what that is? That's called a cube. C-U-B-E. Now, it looks like a box. Let's find out what's inside the box. There's a box. You can put anything in that box that you want to. That's it. Thanks, Professor Roy G. Biv. Treasure! Well, that was far from boring. So many great ideas. Now I know that when I'm faced with a problem, thinking outside the box can help me find the solution. See you, See you next, next time. Did you know you can get special rewards and updates as a patron of wow. Maya Ever and the Ship of Treasure? You can also download activity pages to accompany each episode. Wow! To support this show, join us on Patreon.